All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Never Out. Uh, you know, odds are if I paid more attention at the beginning, I'd know where we're going, just based on like the pattern of like the walls in the room. But I didn't. Oh, there it is. So where's the teleporter? Okay, so I want it to be this way though when I go through it, because then when I should just drop. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, picking up where we left off, we're in the next one. Apparently we're going... Hmm. We're going into uh, the teleporting section. Don't know what I just did. In all honesty. Okay, so this is not what I need right now, actually. Well... Are they both? No, they're not both lined up for that, right? Like, if I drop through this one, I'm not gonna... No, okay. So when I drop through this one, it should teleport me and I should fall through the other one. Yes. Uh, so yeah, last time we did the uh, tutorial and... Uh, we did the tutorial and the magnet section uh, and got how many achievements before we get another one? 8 out of 14 achievements. Uh, so this one we're going to go through the teleport levels and one of the other two. And then we got three secret achievements that I should probably look up but like I said one of them is probably I need to die a certain amount of times. If I had to guess. Um, because, I mean, we've killed ourselves with all of the different, you know, things that we can kill ourselves with. So, I mean, we knocked those out. That one. Alright. It always confuses me when, like, I see it and, like, I'm not falling through it when I see the door. Because it's just like, okay, well, obviously that's how it needs. Oh, and they're going to throw some boxes in here, are ya? Well then. Be like that, eh? That way. This way. This way. Actually, I think I need to go like this, I do believe. Is that right? That doesn't seem right. It's not right. Hang on. One more turn of the room. <laughs> there we go. Now we should be good. Because now they should drop us straight through. Boosh. Nice. Alright. Can we teleport the boxes? I wonder. Let's see. Let's find out. No. Wow, there's a lot of spikes in these boxes. Okay, so we cannot teleport the box, so let's figure out how we need to get in there anyway. Uh, no, that's too much of a space. Okay, so we need to drop in there. Somehow, it's too far away, we can't do it like that. Um, outside, that would drop us there. Okay, so let's get that off the teleporter. So if we went that way, right, end up there, we need the box to be... Okay, there we go. I figured it out. I just need, I couldn't figure out where I needed the box to go, but I think I've got it now. Just like that. Like that. And the box needs to be there. And then I teleport up. And I should be able to walk right into the hole. Perfect. It's weird that they have levels called the box levels, and then they're going to probably have boxes in every single level. All right. What do I need here? Uh, that. Where's this? Okay. Uh, is that how that's going to work? Maybe. All right. Well, only one way. 
way to find out. Oh, there's another secret achievement. Marathoner. Thousand squares in total. Okay, so I've walked over a thousand squares. Another one of the secret achievements. I imagine one is to finish the game. Oh, I think I see. Because then I do this, right? So that it's the right way. And I'll drop right onto it. Nailed it. Uh, but yeah, one's probably to finish. And it wouldn't surprise me if the last one was to die a certain amount of time. I can't imagine that that's a hard achievement to get. Um, hmm. So there's a magnet that'll block off the tele. Oh, I see. It's there. Which means that when we do this, the teleporter won't make us go away. So this is a te the teleport one, but it also has boxes and magnets in it. Sure. Okay. Uh, wait, there's a no, there is not a hole there. Fine. Then you go there. There, which is a really weird thing to do. <laughs> uh, okay. Now what? I got that there, but I mean, I. Okay, well, this should actually make it. Like, it should still be there. This and walk through. Land on the box. Perfect. And then through the hole. But yeah, uh, oh, I think I actually started talking about this in stock in the last part. Uh, I bought this game because it was on sale for like a dollar or something. And I figured, why not? Because, I mean, it's a dollar. Even if it's bad, it's probably going to be a fairly easy thousand gamer score. So, you know, fuck it. Why not? Um... What is the point of this? I need it to be... This way. When I fall through. Correct? Yes. Um, but yeah, I bought this one. I bought... And another one called Don't Knock Twice. That sounded pretty decent. Uh, how good that one will be, I don't know. It's, uh, it's another horror, stealth horror game. Survival horror, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I haven't tried that one yet either. So I figured, hey, because you know, my off time I've been playing Persona. So I figured, hey, I'm not playing that one, I may as well. Do it there. I do have another one as well that I just bought called Mask of Mists, and I was tempted to play that one because I really want to play it, just from the looks of it. Uh, but then I didn't because while I do want to play it, I don't think I want to do videos in it. I think I just want it to be a game that I play, you know. So I guess if I get tired of playing Persona someday or like my PlayStation controller dies because I do only have the one and my uh, PlayStation is not close enough to where I sit in order to um, in order to have it plugged in while I play oh and okay this out of the blue all right so that's all of those ones that was 10 minutes good god all right uh, I guess let's, I mean, Green Thumb was finished the electric levels, and then that's the box levels, so. You know what, let's go and do the box levels, in theory. I'm only assuming that that's the electric ones, because it said Green Thumb, even though this is yellow, which would lead me to believe it's the electric ones. 
Because in theory, the box level should be non not have a box in it. What? Okay. So interestingly enough, the box level starts with no box. Uh, okay. Maybe it's called the box levels because you're in a box, but I mean, then once again, that would still apply to literally every other level. Nope, still no boxes. Alright, oh, whatever. I mean, I would consider these the gravity levels then. But once again, that also applies to every level, so. This way, and off we go. Ah, oh, now the question is, is do I, because let's see, if it, there's 12 levels per those, we did 20, that would be, that would be a weird amount of levels. So it'd be 20, 32, 44, 20, yeah, so 20, 32, 44, 56, 68. And I still say that there's 100 levels, which would be 32 for the final one, which is, is that can't be right. No, that, yeah, that'd be right. Wow, uh, yeah, weird. Okay, where am I going? I'm going right there, which means I need to fall off of don't know. Uh, I need to fall off of there. Which means I need to get to there first. Which means I need to get to there. Which means I need to get to there. Alright. Just like a maze. Just working backwards. Except your perspective gets shifted. Very rapidly and weirdly. Not weirdly. I guess like it makes sense. Just... Oh my god. That, okay, well, I found the boxes. Needless to say, I have in fact found the boxes. Alright, let's move them to this side. I'm assuming just, yeah. See, why, what, that's, I can guarantee you that's why they put it against the wall. Because <laughs> there's no reason that they couldn't have put the the exit one more the exit like in the middle but no they put it right against the wall specifically so that that would happen to at least one person hello uh let's go for a trip um i don't know where the exit is Bring those two down. Ah, there's the exit. Um, okay, I can do that. I can do that. That seems right. Go. Good, good. Uh, well, you know what? Let's go this way first. And then this way. Because why not? Do I see it? I do not. Actually, do this and then get on the boxes. And then let's put them this way to see if I can uncover it. My exit? No. Okay. I mean, as long as I stay on top of the boxes, there should be no way for me to crush myself, right? In theory. Although, man, I hope this door opens faster than those boxes come down. <laughs> Oh, I can see the exit this time. Let's do that immediately. Uh, if I do that, will I die? Yes. If I do that anywhere else, will I die? Yes. If I do this, I should be fine. Do that. Uh, there. Ooh, it shifted all of it, though. Not exactly what I wanted. Let's do this. Now that should have. Okay. So 
actually, since it's fine like this, I should be able to do this. And that should... There it is. I was like, where the fuck is the exit? I could have swore that it was. Ugh. It's probably the hardest part of this one. It's just remembering where the exit is. Alright. Come over here, and then here for some reason. I'm assuming that that's right. Oh, right, actually, easier than I was. I, I See, I was trying to do something more complicated, which is the problem with stuff like this. Like, they, you know, every once in a while you get a puzzle game and it's like, oh, okay, I know what I need to do. But then, like, you try and do all this stuff and you're, like, 12 moves in. Uh when you realize that there was no need for pretty much any of what you just did. Uh, if I do that, will that help? No. It's not enough, is it? No. Do that. Go back. We'll go up. And there we go. Now, technically, I think you could have done that in any corner of the room, so... Excuse me, there is a message for you. Oh, would you piss off? Alright. Um... I think I see... Yes, I do. Go for a ride. Straighten myself up here. I say straighten myself up, I mean... Technically, every way is up in this game. Honestly, maybe starting to hurt my eyes just a little bit. Not gonna lie. I don't I don't know if it's like the constant like shifting or something, but yeah, I, I think my eyes might be starting to hurt just the tiniest bit. You here. Uh, get you there. And over here. There. The other one I was thinking of doing, uh, if I didn't do Sherlock Holmes, is, uh, oh, and that, really? That was so quick. So, so quick. Um, but yeah, the other one I was thinking of, was that even 12? Sure was, alright. Uh, was, I was gonna look into how much the Mass Effect, uh, legendary whatever it's called that just came out was because I mean we did Andromeda and I love the Mass Effect series uh, so I was so yeah I might look into how much that one is I don't want to spend too much right now on a new game for this but I don't think I did this right because this does me zero good but at the same time, I don't... Okay. So clearly that was wrong. Should just drop me right back onto there. That does me no good. Okay, you know what? I think I'm not necessarily overthinking it. I think I'm using the wrong... wrong thing here. No, because I can't walk off crossways like that. Not to mention that doesn't work anyway. Do that. I can walk off there, but that doesn't do anything. If I'm here, I can walk off left and right, but that doesn't do anything. I need to somehow get my... Yeah, I'm just a fucking idiot. Never mind. Never mind, just me being absolutely stupid. Am I though, actually, come to think of it? Because I need to be... Yes, yes I am, just being stupid, alright. See, I really like the Mass Effect, but my issue with... The only real issue I have with 
doing oh, fuck, fuck, okay. with doing the Mass Effect uh, legendary thing is it's a big commitment because if I start it, I am going to do all three. Obviously, that's a lot of games, and uh, that would take up a very long time. Although, come to think of it, maybe not as long as I'm thinking because there's not really. Well, I guess it depends, because, like, in the first game, like, if I do... Wait, what happens if the... I'm assuming the box can just go through the electricity. Because, like, if I do only... Like, if I don't do the... Because, like, in the first game, right, the thing that would take me the longest would be all of the individual planets, right? Because each of them has some form of side quest or something attached to them, right? Um, but there's also a lot of them that, realistically, there's, there's nothing. I mean, like, there's basically nothing anyway. Um, so, I mean, like, I could do those off camera. Um. So yeah, I don't know. I'll see how much it is. Because, I mean, it is three games in once they are remastered. As far as I've heard, like, I haven't heard too much about it since it came out, in all honesty. Which, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I mean... Uh, I can't, like, it, obviously it can't be any worse than the original was. And the original was pretty fucking good. I don't know where I'm going with this, by the way. I honestly have no idea. I think I may need to try and get it into this box, but I don't know how I would manage that. Or how that would necessarily help me. If I put it there, I could send it up that way, maybe. Yeah, that's what I gotta do. I just gotta make the loop. Um, but then, like, in the second game, I guess the only thing that really took me any real length of time in the second game, outside of, like, actual quests, was the mining stuff, which I could very easily do off-camera. I don't think there's ever... I don't think that anybody would have any doubt that that's something that nobody would fucking care if I left out of the videos. Oops. Oh, whatever. Doesn't matter. Um... And then for three, I'm not sure. I mean, I'm wondering how they did three because in uh, me, in uh, the original, when you did, when you got your uh, war assets, um, if you wanted to make full use of them, you had to play the multiplayer mode. Now, as far as I'm aware, based on looking at the achievements, the multiplayer mode has been removed, which is, it's fine. Uh, Mass Effect multiplayer was one of the few multiplayers I actually liked because I feel like I could actually... Because it was all PvE. Like, it wasn't a PvP at all. Which is probably why I enjoyed it. But, uh... I, I did rather, like I said, enjoy it. Uh, but they took it out. But yeah, like, your war assets that you got in 3 when you... did You only got to use, I want to say, maybe even only 50% of them. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I guess I can go this way as well. And now I'm here for no reason. Um, but yeah, it may have only been 50% of them. Uh, and then as you did more PvP, it, uh, it unlocked, I guess unlocked might not be the right word. Uh, you could that like it would then use more of them that you had gathered. Uh, so like if you had so like every time you did a PvP match, it would uh, let your war assets go up a little bit more at a time because you were like taking pressure off of them by doing whatever PvP you did. You know, if I did that, that would kill me, wouldn't it? Yep, yeah, sure would. Um, I 
like that when you talk with it. Yeah. Is there a gate there? I honestly can't tell. I mean, there must be. I had to catch it somewhere, right? No, nope, actually, I caught it there, so I need to go this way. And then... So it's there. And then I need it to go back that way, but I need to be over here. Correct? Sure. Uh, but yeah, it's just such a huge fucking commitment to do. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's a lot. I mean... And the thing is, right, is if I did get it, I don't know if I'd want to replace. Although we are almost done, because I was going to say, like, I don't want to be doing two that are that long at the same time, because, you know, we would have that and Assassin's Creed going. But at the same time, I mean, Assassin's Creed, I, I want to say that we're almost done. That could, based on what I did today, though, that could very easily be a lie. All right, we've got a teleporter that leads us in there and may very well kill us. We need to get this to that magnet. Hmm. Yeah, I think I got this on the wrong side. Let's go Let's take a little trip. I think this is right. Could be wrong. Could very easily be wrong, but yes, this is right. All right, good. So we do this. I should put it there and we can do this um I guess we can go the other way so I don't get electrocuted although come to think of it I think I may have fucked up again because then that brings it down oh yeah I can't go that way anyway Go back, down, drop it around, drop it there, and when I go through there, that would just straight up kill me. Um, how the fuck do I do this? Because if I go either way, left or right, it's going to move out of the way that I need it. So I don't quite understand how I'm supposed to flip it all the way around. I mean, I need it to be held in place by somewhere as I go. That. I wanted that. Okay, so now it's against there. So if I go up to here, it'll move there. I don't need I don't want that though. I need to go either That way I feel like I'll just be fucked again, right? But if I go... Because if I go up on this wall, what will that do? It will drop it straight across. Right? Maybe? Yes. That. There we are. 
Fucking hell, alright. And here I thought the electric ones would be the easier of them, but I guess the fact that I am limited like that in the way I can move really does kind of screw me up a little bit. Okay, fall through there, and then I can get to be this way though when I go through. Oh, good god, alright. I mean, I don't know how the final levels are going to be harder than this. I mean, we have teleporters, boxes, electricity. The only Actually, we haven't done spikes yet, have we? We haven't got any fucking spikes. We had that one room with spikes, and that was it. Okay, so I have two boxes, but it looks like I only need one. If I step through the teleporter, I am 100% dead. Uh... Let's do this, I guess. And then... Up here. Okay, that should move them there. Do this, that should move that one where I need it to be. Oh, but then if I do that, it'll go away. Go this way. That. Because then this. Whoops. Should lock it in there. Glad I moved. Almost didn't. Okay. So now all I should need to do is get to the teleporter right here. And make sure that it's the right way around. Okay, so now if I step in the teleporter should drop me onto the box and hopefully not kill me. It should drop me on there, which... Ah. I see what I need to do now. I see. I very much see. Alright. Where the hell is my phone going? Okay, so I need that to be there, which means I need, what the fuck did I do to get that one there? Oh, there it is, okay. Uh, okay, so I need you to come this way, and then this way. We can go this way. And then wait this way. Just basically have to re redo what I just did, right? So if I go over here, go down, and that way. There you go, and then that shut off the teleporter, and I can make it through. That one was hard, I'll admit. That one tripped me up for a bit. Hey, look at that, we got spikes back. Alright. Well, I mean, obviously... I'm... Now, the question is with the spikes, right? Is, uh... Do the boxes go into the spikes, or not? Also, where is... I'm, I'm standing on my exit, am I not? That uncover it? No, didn't think so. Okay, I can't go on either of those. Wow, alright. Um, no, no, that's death, that's death. Uh, I mean, the only way I can go really is here. And then obviously, if I go up there, that's just going to drop them all on me, and I don't have any way of getting out of the way of them. Uh, maybe that way. So if I go back over here, they should drop back down. Right? Okay. And then if I go that way, no, that'll just drop them on me here. Um, still don't know where my exit is, by the way. 
there's still zero clues to it. All right, so these being here or them being there doesn't matter because of the way those spikes are. Uh, they do not seem to reveal anything on the floor, no matter which way they are. Uh, let me see. I'll do that and bring them down here. Okay, so I can't go left or right because obviously that's just death for me. Um, and then if I go that way, no matter where along that wall I go, that's also death. Uh, if I drop down there, my only options would be to okay. So if I go along that wall, that'll just crush me with those. If I do this, it does almost nothing. But if I do this, don't like the noise that was just made. If I do that, though, I'm dead. Is the issue? I do this, then I can get through it before the boxes crush me. Because it's not the first time we've had to do that. I don't like it when they drop me out like at a wall. Because <laughs> I think that I'm still like falling or still in the tube or something. Okay. There. Do there. Uh, and then do there. It's really weird that it makes that sound. It really is very, very weird. Okay, now that would let me step on there, but obviously once I do that, I'm just stuck on there, whoop, stuck on there with the box and probably dead. So I can slide it that way. Does that this way, unless I was supposed to bring it the other way first. Maybe. Oh, does it? Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. If I do it that way, that will slide it back, right? Yeah. Okay, so right there it does me zero good, correct? Yes. Now, actually, come to think about it, what the fuck am I even aiming for right now? Like, let me get a look at this. Okay, so I need to fall in there. I have no idea how to do that. Oh, I need the box to be there. Okay, hang on. Okay, I now know where I need the box to be. I may not know what I'm supposed to do once the box is there, but I know where the box is supposed to be. If the box is there, right, and then I bring it this way, And then I need to get in there, which is obviously going to be easy. Maybe. Well, not so much if I do it like that, but. Uh, this way? No, that's the wrong side, isn't it? Yep, sure is. Fuck. Is it? What am I. What was I doing in the first place? If I have it there and then there, but then I don't know how to get... Oh my lord, I am just fucking... not grasping this one. Okay. Back to the beginning, more or less. Where do I need this box to be to get into that thing there. I think it 
think I see how I'm gonna do, or how I'm supposed to do it. It's yeah, I think so. Okay. First things first. Is I need you back over here, and I need to leave. Get you down here. Over here. And now here. After that nice little squishy sploosh, your sploosh that it does there. Get in there. So I can then get you over there. And then get you down here. What the fuck was my plan here? Oh, I think I see. Because I need you there. And then I should be able to... Yes, there we go. Alright. It was weird. Like, I figured it out. And then, like, when I was almost done, I just completely lost the plot. And I was like, wait. None of this is correct. That one like that. And lock that one there. Good, now they're both locked in place. Was that really it? After what I just went through, this was the next puzzle. I feel like that one was out of place. Just saying, that seemed awfully easy. Okay, so this one is, okay, I need to get that there. Not that I know how to do that, and I don't also know what Uh, okay, so I need that there, so I need this to go over here, and again, and where am I going with this? I need it. Seriously. What did I just do? I feel like I had it, and then once again, just absolutely lost the plot. Um, oh, there we go. Did lose it, because I lost where, where I lost my one platform. There it is. Okay, now I needed you there. Oh, there we go. I'm just losing track. There's too many just, like, like barely sticking out things, you know. Okay, and then I can do this and walk off. And let me do this and walk off. Perfect. And that was number. Oh no, this is number twelve. So this should be the last one. Okay. Hello, teleport. I mean, why even? Why even? What the? Where's the exit? All I see are death holes. I do not see an exit anywhere. What is that? Do I care? I do not. Um. Oh, there's the exit. Okay, how do I get onto. Okay, well this lets me do this. This lets me go and stand on that platform. I walk off there. Which will let me be... This way. Yes, and now I am out of the spikes. And back to one. Okay, so there's the green thumb, and now we unlock that one. Yeah! Okay. Check our achievements. Two left. Two secret achievements. And you know what? I am going to quickly look it up just to see if it is just like beat the last level and... Uh, 
so never out achievements, boosh, true achievements, uh, killed by block, killed by spikes, electrocuted, 30 tiles on a single level plane, running in circles, okay. Uh, we did that, we did that, and use teleport 30 times. Yeah, so we need to use teleport 30 times and then run around in a circle, apparently. Okay, so I mean, like, if I just do this, we should get an achievement. How many is that? One, two, three, four. Whoops. Okay, so two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That should be, yeah, that was more than enough. Right in circles. Alright, so then all we need to do then is get a teleporter and we can do the other achievement as well, which apparently has nothing to do with finishing the game. What does this do now? Oh, this is the credits. Okay. Oh no, it's all boxes. Whatever shall we do? Okay, seriously though, now what do we do? Because like I would like to uh, go and get my last achievement. So that was it, actually. Two parts. I couldn't even extend it into three parts. That is how short the game is. <laughs> Wait. Did I do three? That was Wednesday. Never out Monday. Oh yeah, look at that. Could not extend it into three parts. That is how short this game was. Um. Okay. Well, I mean, let's go. Which one was teleport? Uh, again. I still have it up on my phone. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, finished teleport levels was blue. So all we need is the blue one. Sure, we'll go to 12. It's not like it matters. Although it probably does. Because we probably should have went to... Uh, yeah, actually, you know what? Let's go back to change level. Well, I do wish to stick with blue. Actually, mine. Go all the way back to number one because odds are that's going to be two portal things that we can just walk in and out of over and over again. So, boop, drop, and actually, if I face this way, I should just be able to. Yeah. All right, so. That was never out, the whole two parts, leaving me with still needing to record something else for Friday, unfortunately. Um, I have absolutely no idea what to record for Friday. Maybe I will turn on that Mask and Mist game that I bought and just like say, hey, I'm not planning on doing it. Hey, there's, there it is. Blink power. Teleport used 30 times. And look at that. 100% in two parts. In under an hour and a half I think even I think the first part was under a half hour this one isn't even an hour so yeah I mean if you followed a guide you could probably get this game a hundred percent in an hour or if you figured out a couple of the I mean to be fair none of the puzzles really trapped me up or trapped me up until we got to a couple of those electric ones and a couple of those box ones like I mean but yeah that's yeah, that's it. That's the whole game. So thanks everybody for watching. And now I must find something else to record. <laughs>